What's up everyone? Welcome to the show. Please like today's episode and subscribe for more WWE news. Ladies and gentlemen, the articles from linked in the description for you below. It's from RAJH.com. Let's get into the WWE news. A new stipulation for Extreme Rules match for Natalia vs. Charlotte for the WWE Women's Title Belt Championship match this Sunday live on the WWE Network. Now, Monday, uh, Monday's night edition of Raw. A new stipulation was announced for this Sunday's WWE Women's Championship match at Extreme Rules between Charlotte and Natalia. It was revealed during Monday's show that not only is Ric Flair banned from ringside at Extreme Rules this Sunday on the network, but if he is if he makes his way down at ringside at any point during the match when Natalia faces Charlotte one on one for the women's title this Sunday Charlotte will be forced to forfeit the title to Natalia now now in my opinion I don't see Natalia winning I don't I don't see Natalia winning now Charlotte's been cheating ever since like Ric Flair's been you know been there all the time Charlotte cheats all the time because of Ric Flair. Now, in my opinion, I want to see what she can do without her dad being there. Now, in my opinion, she's trying to live in her dad's footsteps. She's trying to be like her dad. She's not being herself. She's not being creative. She's not thinking smart. She's not being Charlotte. She's being Ric Flair. Okay? With the, now she has her own robe now, which she doesn't need her own robe. Okay, she doesn't need her own robe because Ric Flair had one and now she wants to have one. She's not being herself. She's being Ric Flair. She's living in Ric Flair's shadows. You know, she's supposed to be Charlotte. She's supposed to be herself, not be what her dad is. I get it. She's a Flair. They're related. They're, fam they're family. I get that. But you got to be yourself. You can't be like your dad. You can't be like this. You got to be creative. You got to be smart and have your own legacy. Don't, you know, that's... So my opinion, you know, I'm not a fan of her as a heel, you know. And, you know, everybody's like, wondering, well, why, you know, is Natalia going to get... Enough? Is Natalia going to win the title and then she's going to get it back, you know, Charlotte will get it back the next night. Is it going to happen like that, you know? She wins it, Monday Night Raw... Gets the title back. Charlotte gets the title back on Raw. You know, Charlotte gets a rematch on Raw. You know, well, you know, this is it. So now it makes it more interesting, you know. So if Flair even comes down, the, the she'll forfeit the title, which I know Flair is not going to come down. You know, they're trying to make us think like, oh, wow, this is going to be interesting. You know, if Flair comes down, the, you know, the title, she forfeits the title. Charlotte, Natalia is not going to win this. You know, that's why I'm really not looking forward to this match because know, we all know, and you guys know, Charlotte is going to win. Charlotte's going to retain her title. But there's probably, they're probably going to find a way to get Ric Flair, you know, in ringside somehow. They're going to, she, Charlotte's going to try everything she can to get Flair down ringside to cheat still. To make a win by cheating still. They're good. She's going to find a way. So you guys let me know. What do you guys think about the new stipulation as well? Also that he's banned. But if he also comes by ringside, she forfeits the title. What do you guys think about that? Let me know in the comments below. Until then, I'll see you on the next show. Subscribe.